I don't want to go to school. I'd rather join the army. Are you a One chaos crystal, just like you ordered. Just don't ask for any more. <laughs> That's incredible. May I borrow it for a while? Of course. As promised, I'll have a prototype weapon ready for you soon. Can you come by the front desk to pick it up later? I can't stop thinking about the incident in 13AF. The one you managed to stop. I keep coming back to the part where Alyssa and I were killed in Augusta Tower, before history was changed. For some reason, I'm not so sure the AI was acting on its own. What makes you think so? There's no denying the AI was out of control. I just wonder, was that really an accident? I've said it before, but I don't know how to thank you enough. We have all 
the data and materials we need. Prepare yourselves. The real battle is yet to come. Sorry to keep you waiting. I assume you're here for the Paradox Weapon prototypes. We have a large box and a small box. Which one will you take with you? You're not going to tell us what's inside them? <laughs> I'm just teasing. You'll have a chance to look them over. Which model would you prefer? It's all yours. I know you'll make good use of it. I hope this was worth it after all that. Well, that's going to be up to us. We will change the future. I promise you. All right! If you present me with any fragments you obtain, I will offer you some guidance.
you be blessed! Even the prizes have been affected Did by the paradox. like an oracle drive. Yeah. Stop. <gasps> Sarah! Lightning. Sarah, 
I'm sorry. Hey, hey, hey. the apologies can wait. We got a wedding to plan, right? It's no use, right? Like, come on. What do you say? Lightning, I swear to you, I will make her happy. I believe you. My memories. They're real, aren't they? Possible. If you change the future, you change the past. <laughs> it keeps changing? <laughs> Change is the constant. <laughs> Caius. I have seen you. I have seen you both. You? What? You mean Osiris? I am not the you you know. But... <sighs> you must understand, there are many Yules. Caius. Wait, I saw you. My sister was fighting you. What are you doing here in this time? I learned of your journey, leaping back and forth along the timeline. Yule has been watching everything you do. No. She's been watching us? Yes. I see you understand the significance of that. Then you must also understand that I am here for a reason. Your actions have necessitated the strictest sanctions. We have been
In the instant Caius was defeated, the effects rippled down the timeline. In the village of Erba, Sarah and Noel see that things are not as they were before. Twisted mockeries of humans sprawl lifeless among the buildings. The scars of war that should have long since faded appear fresh and raw. Is this the world of the past, or is it the reflection of someone's memory? Sarah hears a faint voice calling her, and sets off to investigate. When we came to, we found ourselves in the town of Erba. We were in a world that had been devastated by the War of Transgression, hundreds of years before I was born. All traces of humanity were replaced with monstrous seeth. People had been stripped of their normal lives. Denied even a human death, they wandered the ruins of their home. I thought I heard a faint whisper, a familiar voice. Could it be the voice of someone who lived here long ago? The voice of someone begging to be heard? The war against Cocoon, it was inevitable. The army of Grand Pulse was annihilated by the overwhelming power of the Falci. Countless lives were lost. But I didn't fight. I couldn't. Not even to protect my friends, the people I love. To hate, to hurt, to destroy, I refused to accept my focus. I was sad. I was scared. That's why I decided to run. I left Fang to deal with everything. We vowed to protect each other, and I broke that promise. I'm the reason. I'm the reason Fang was forced to carry the burden of the monster of Ragnarok. Because I was weak. Because I abandoned her. Fang, where are you? I have to make up for what I did. Or else... Anil? Is that you? So the voice you heard before? It belonged to Vanille, Kubo. Vanille, listen. I know what it's like. You're trapped in crystal, but your soul is still alive. You're sleeping, but your thoughts are still awake. I know, because I experienced that too. I can feel your pain. I can feel your sorrow, your grief, and your remorse. I know there's someone you want to apologize to. Can you give us some time? I promise we'll find Fang and bring her here so you can tell her how you feel. Thank you. I know that one day we'll be released again. Only then can we ask for forgiveness. That is the fate time has in store for us. But fate also brought you here to this place to hear my plea. All roads are connected somehow. And they all lead to a time of salvation when imprisoned souls will be freed. They all lead to the end of the world and a new beginning. <laughs> 